Latino voters are at the center of attention this year. Both parties are focusing on immigration, health care, and the economy to connect with Latino communities. Howard University student Andre De Santos says that Latinos are crucial in this election. Latinos are the sleeping giant of the political uh, spectrum, so once they wake up, you know, they're going to make a major difference in politics. In 2020, Latinos made history as the second largest voting bloc in the country. A study done by the Pew Research Center shows that by 2050, Latinos are projected to comprise of nearly 30% of the U.S. population, a shift that has both parties striving to connect with this critical group. Howard University professor Dr. Kwame Dixon says both parties must address the needs of this growing population to secure victory. They understand that's the next electoral tsunami, and they need to be attentive to the electoral needs of that particular group. Donald Trump sought Latino support through endorsements from artists like Anuel, though a spokesperson Tony stated that Tony Hinchcliffe's floating Middle island of garbage, garbage comment about Puerto Rico didn't reflect the campaign. Rico. On the other hand, Kamala Harris has support from Latino artists like Mark Anthony. American University PhD candidate Jennifer Lopez says Latinos aren't focused on immigration. Not really the, the top issue that's driving Latinos um, to vote or or to signal who they're supporting. Um, really, the, the top issue for voters, especially Latinos, is the economy. As Latinos vote this year, both parties count on their support. Chantilly McFarland for HE News Service.